Hello everybody, welcome back to Creature Creator, where we have an abomination. No, actually, um, yeah, I recreated Nursilla from uh, Monster Hunter series. So we have kind of a spider creature now. She's a bit slow, but she's trying her best. Uh, also, while I was panning the camera around here, I did notice there is stuff behind the waterfall. That being said, I don't know if I can swim. I don't think I can. Sure can't. Okay. Um, in that case, let me load up somebody else. Uh, okay. Well, let's go creamsicle, I guess. I did start working on another one. Too. You saw it in the list there, the pumpkin. Um, but I do not have enough body parts nor money for the design I'm going for on that one. So that's going to be a bit. We got a wild sniffer. Oh, we got a hog nose. And we got a dangler fish. Oh, is that what I need for caves? Does that make it light? On Nursilla, I did put eye or um, a nose and ears. So let's just see here for a sec. If we take Nursilla to the cave, can she sprint? She cannot sprint. I couldn't figure out how to stick uh, feet onto her feet, for lack of a better way to put that. Because she. The bug legs are legs, but yeah, I couldn't figure out how to attach the feet. I don't know if it was because they were too long. Okay. So I cannot see. So let's go grab that angler fish part. Maybe that'll let me see in the cave. So I guess, am I an omnivore? I can pick up the fruit. I think I'm actually a carnivore because I have the weird mouth, like the needly mouth, you know? Um, so I think I'm actually a carnivore. But let me build here. Okay. Yeah, abilities. Luminous. Okay. So we are just going to stick that on you. I don't love it as a permanent fixture though, so I'm not going to save. And yeah, I can see parts over on the other side of the water there. We'll get there eventually. I do just want to poke my head into this cave though and see what there is. Apparently spiders. I also have a shoot attack, so if I... I don't know how I, like, check the range on that. I think it only goes a certain range. But anyways, I can shoot spikes. Oh, look at my shadow. That is horrifying, and I love it. Ah, <laughs> uh, this game is fun. If you guys haven't picked this up yet, I would highly recommend it. It is... Oh, hi, spiders. Ow. He's been alive for 70 minutes. Oh my god. Okay, I've been playing for way too long. It's fine. <laughs> Most of it was spent just, you know, derping around in the editor. It took a while to make Nursilla, alright? She's a little complex. Oh. No. Stop it. I wish I could choose my attack. Oh, okay. We're just gonna om nom nom that. I wish I could choose my attack instead of, like, defaulting between biting and shooting and spinning. Got a rodent sniffer. Is there, there's got to be like some platform that I can do in this cave, right? Unfortunately, I am not a jumper. She's more of a crawler. Oh yeah, there is. Okay. So I might have to come back here with creamsicle and just stick a. Oh, there's a there's an area. Okay. Might have to come back here as creamsicle and just stick like the anglerfish part on him. Try across. Okay, more pattern. Oh, I still have the bone. Look at her carrying her bone. How adorable. So yeah, that's just a pattern by the looks of it. There is the cave. Why don't I unlock the cave so that uh, when I start an adventure, I can at least just go to the cave, you know? Because you have to unlock it first. And I know there was the sandbox that we didn't unlock yet either. You know what, actually? Let's bum around the cave for a few minutes. Let's see what we got around here. Oh, okay, it's just putting me right here. Uh, nope. You know what? I like Nursilla. We're just gonna play. So we've got Armored Eye. Ooh. And Thick Squiggle. Okay, that's a cool pattern. I appreciate that one. So there's, yeah, there's stuff up here. Can I walk up here? Eh. Oh, we got some weird eyeball stalks. Okay. And there's also no music in the cave, which is kind of sad. Arrow foilet. 
Oh, are those kind of like bug wings, maybe? There's a critter, apparently, Roman. Uh, okay, so where does that lead me? Out? I think that leads me out. Okay, so we have a huge cave to explore. That goes down. So this must be where I came from, right? God, she's so slow. I gave her a really thick body plan because, you know, she is a spider, but... I say spider loosely. I'm aware that she has, like, six legs, I think, but I'm pretty sure Nurcilla only has six legs. At least from the picture I was looking at. She's a bit slow. <laughs> but we love her. Yeah, is this just taking me back to, yeah, to the farm? Okay. Yeah, we'll go back to the farm for now. Can I skip this? No. I like that it shows her. That's pretty neat. Yeah, we'll go back to the farm. Maybe I'll stick a light on Cream's Coal, come back to this cave. Oh, okay. Uh, let me load up. So we didn't save Nursilla, that's fine. Creamsicle, load. Creamsicle, god, you are such a monstrous mess. You're kind of just my, like, uh, you know, when I need to get places and do things, it's like, okay, we're just sticking everything on Creamsicle now. Alright, Creamsicle. Now, where did that cave? It's way over there. One second. Let me do one of those. Okay, let's speed run the last pattern in the cave here. Spiders should all be gone now. I did murder them as Nursilla, although I did reload the area. Oh yeah, there's spiders, okay. Oh yeah! Yeah, Creamsicle's not great for fighting. He doesn't have any, like, extra bits on him for fighting. Oh, were there two spiders there? I don't know, but we're eating them. Okay. Come on. Oh, I should have actually taken Burb, huh? Oh, is Cream Skull too fat to fly? He might be. <laughs> okay, yeah, I think I actually need to get Burb one sec. Oh. oh, that puts me up here. Oh. Okay, so we can actually go to places we haven't unlocked. Interesting. Uh, well, I guess I'll- Ooh, we got bat wings! Oh, that's exciting! Oh, and we got a- is that a different beak? We got an actual beak. Okay. Let's grab Burb and then we'll uh I'll fix Burb up and then I'll put the anglerfish on him. One sec. Okay, we now have a ridiculous looking burb. <laughs> but I do like his beak. It is pretty fancy. Oh wait, there's a body part on the way down to the cave. Oh his leg. What is your leg doing, Burb? The terrain is not playing nicely with you, huh? He's trying. Uh, I did look at the dragon looking wings. Skull eye. Ooh. I did look at the dragon wings and they do give flap level two, which is interesting. So we might have to make just like a dragon at some point because that sounds cool. Okay. Let's go get this last pattern for realsies this time. <laughs> Now that I have a critter that can actually fly, we might have to uh, really revamp Creamsicle later. Maybe make him a little thinner and uh, so that he can run faster and fly a little better. He's kind of our all-terrain guy, but... Oh, get out of here, spider. Yeah, his health bar is gone, but... And I am an herbivore. Okay. So we can't eat the spider. I guess. Yeah, so it is pretty interesting that like your weight dictates how well flap level one works. Because again, we only have flap level one on these bird wings. Oh, there is stuff up here. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Tentacle beard. Maybe I can put that on my head. I need some hair for braviary. <laughs> Uh, sorry, distractions. It is pretty cool, though, that, like, if you have a smaller body plan, flap level one does work better for you. I do appreciate stuff like that, right? Where it's, like, the trade-off of, okay, you know, you want a big, chunky body, but then you can't fly very well because your weight is higher. That is pretty neat. Okay, so let me just save that. His body pattern disappeared at one point. It was kind of annoying. Can I put that? Oh my gosh. 
<laughs> I mean, I know it's meant as a beard. Can I just like do that? But then there we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're nailing this. Oops. Oh, heck. There we go. Uh, maybe a little bit bigger. A little bit bigger. Gotta give him those luscious locks, you know? I should have looked if that actually gave me anything. I don't think it does. Okay, vibrance. Saturation down. Slightly yellower. Or oranger, I mean. Nailing it. Okay. Build. Tentacle beard allows me to swim. I mean, my feeties already did that, but... Yeah, it's weird that, like... If you're not in the paint menu, for some reason the body pattern seems to disappear on me and I don't know why. It's a little annoying, but... Okay, now that we have proper braviary hair, he looks like spaghetti. Oh, let's actually go to the middle of the lake there, hey? Oh, there's a campground. You guys can see the campground over there in the distance? We. I think it would be really cool also to make like a very highly efficient swimmer. Not that swimming's bad, like, you'll see when he gets in the water here, he actually swims half decently. I think Cream Skull swam better. Swam? Swam better? Um, Burb does okay. A little awkward. I wish their limbs moved a little more when they, when they swam. It is a little weird to just kind of, like, float across the water, but, you know. Yeah, okay, let's do a sprinty sprint. Ooh, that's a funky stinger. Okay, I thought maybe that was a limb, but... A face blesser. Oh, it's got a tongue in the middle. Gross. So we got a stinger. We could make a mana core. Pelican. Okay, let's actually go to the campsite here. Because this looks intriguing. Oh, there is a... Um, whatchamacallit, a build station over here. But you know what? Let's fly across the lake, because we are a bird and we can just do that. Actually, let's go grab this first. Eh. 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 I do need some better tails. Um, I did get that reptile tail, and when I was playing around with the pumpkin design, I tried it, but it seems to go on upside down, which is a little unfortunate. Like, the scales were upside down, and I couldn't figure out how to get them right way up. So I don't know if you can or not. Which is unfortunate, but... Oh, we got some more frog grippies? Frog feet. Okay, so we have frog hands and frog feet. Oh, wait, I should probably be eating these, shouldn't I? There we go. Get my stamina back. Aha, I was gonna say, there's definitely gonna be something in the tent. I also suspect that fire would hurt me. There's a key. Oh, come on, burb. You can wedge yourself in there, bud. There you go. Draconic. Oh, okay. That's a pretty cool, like, face shape. What does the key do? It must unlock something, right? There's an outhouse. Do I get an achievement for sitting on the toilet? Nope. Can I drop the key down the toilet, though? Oh, I don't have any hands. I'd have to use Creamsicle. Does the trampoline work? Oh, the trampoline doesn't work? Come on, game. You can't tease me like that. I also appear to have lost my music again, I see. Hmm. We're getting a lot of dino heads. Megazor. Okay, let me grab, uh, you know what, let's actually do Nursilla here, because she's got some grippies. I know it's kind of hard to see, but like just below her jaw there, those like orangey wedge ones, those are technically arms. Because I figured it would be kind of handy if she could grab stuff. Yoink. So we are going to do that. Can I drop the key in the toilet? Can I fit in the bathroom? Bonk. No, no, didn't quite get it. Bonk? <laughs> he is somewhat in the toilet. Okay. I don't know what that unlocks. I suspect that does something for us eventually. I'm not sure what, though. Okay. Burr. Let's go. Actually, let me get my music back one sec. Audio. Yeah, it's supposed to be playing Wistful Harp. Maybe because we were in the cave because the cave doesn't have music. I, I think maybe that kind of messed with it. Alright, burp. Let's actually do a sprint, yeah. 
So sprinting is really kind of required to move around, unless you have four legs. Antenna. That's fun. Um, if you have four legs, it's not quite as bad, but... Ooh, those look good. Spikes. Exoesqueletico. Exoskeleton, I'm guessing. That might be good for Nursilla. She does need some more spikes on her. Although I was running out of money, so I need to do, like, quests or something. Because it looks like you have a set amount of money for when you build a new critter. Ooh. Sharp antlers, okay. Um, and you do get that full amount of money. Like, it doesn't matter how many critters you have, you get the full amount. Is that another spiky mouth thing? Peregna, okay. But yeah, I have, I think it was $600 is what I'm up to. Which is good. Hi guys. Good boy, 20 bucks. Oh, do I get money for killing the dog? Oh, do I not get... I, I don't know. I'm probably supposed to like... Oh, I'm probably supposed to give them meat or something. Okay. So yeah, I need to do like these quests to get more money. Yeah, I bet I'm supposed to bring the meat. Yeah, because there's meat over there. Okay. Maybe I can... I guess I can reload the map later. Might have to do that. I mean, I could also just complete this on my own time later. It's not like we're necessarily going for 100% in this playthrough. I kind of just want to explore the maps and get as many of the body parts as I can. Oh, we got the pigtail over here. Okay. You entered reservoirs. Ooh, clipping through the ground there. Oh, spiral horn. Okay. Maybe they use that as the pigtail, though, because it did kind of work as a pigtail. There's the apiary again. So do I have... No, I'm missing... Oh, I'm missing a lot of body parts. Where are they all? How am I missing so many body parts? I don't... I wish there was, like, an in-between for the map. It's not counting, like, the sandbox, is it? How am I missing so many body parts and patterns? And I have none of the quests in here. Okay. Um, let's go to the sandbox, then. I am curious. Let's let's go see what this sandbox thing is about. Again, I think it's just another area, kind of like how the cave was. I probably should have been Nursilla for this. Although, there might be some flying involved. Oh, this is the soccer minigame, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, so if you have friends or you play online, you can play soccer with them here. Eiffel, and I like the checkerboard pattern. That's fun. So yeah, if I just go womp womp. <laughs> oh, I should probably actually get one in one of the buckets. There's probably an achievement for, yeah, blue toys. I get 75 bucks. Oh wait, blue toys. Oh, okay. So I need some grippy grips. So I could use Nursilla, um, but she does not have sprint, which is too bad. So let's actually... Uh, whoop. And we will load up Creamsicle. Because he's got some grippy grips, and he's got a sprinty sprint. Oh, I see something floating up there. Okay. Does this count as a blue toy? I think so. Yeah, you can see though, Creamsicle is built a bit tankily. So he, uh, he can't fly very well. <laughs> blue toys. That does count. Okay. So let's do a nice little speed up of me collecting all of these. And you know what? Let's get a goal while we're at it. Bonk. <laughs> no achievement? Come on, game. Okay, so yeah, we just got an extra 75 bucks, which is fantastic, actually. Uh, that's quite a bit of money for making critters, not gonna lie. Considering I had 600 before, and that just gave me $75, that's a lot of money. Okay, I suspect there's a red toy one as well. I'm gonna preemptively grab this because... Yeah, red toy's also 75 bucks. Okay, so we can just get $150 for doing this here. That is not too shabby. So again, let me just grab these and I'll be right back. And 
Let me get my $75. Nice. Okay, so let me switch over to Burb so we can fly up and get the part that I think was up there. Uh, Bill, let me load Burb. Right? Like, I'm pretty sure... Oh, it was behind me. Okay. Gotcha. Thank you, Minimap. Yeah, it's on top of there. I can see it. Okay. Let me get this. Uh, snibbity snab. I've unlocked all the parts and patterns in the sandbox. Okay, lobster pincer. Yep, makes sense. Oh, okay, so you can just go back to the farm at any point here. Okay, yeah, we've done all the quests and we got all the patterns and stuff. So that was a nice little area. Nice easy one. Got $150. So yeah, you can see, like, I have 395, and if I went here, uh, if I unselect Burb, I'll just show you guys quick. So if you, yeah, so I, I now have $750, which is great, because I do need that money. <laughs> uh, but let me just do, um, I guess we'll do Burb. Load Burb. So yeah, again, don't know how I'm missing so many body parts and all that, because yeah, the Sandbox didn't count, I don't think. So it's probably from doing some of these quests. Or am I missing something really obvious? Maybe? Perhaps. Well, what is that over there? That just keeps going. Okay. I don't know. There's a lot of those dogs and stuff too, and they were a quest. Oh, there's a body part there. So if I Oh, there's body parts here. Oh, it's because I haven't been to this part of the map. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So, yeah, hi puppy. Are you a good boy too? You're not a good boy. I don't... Oh, you are a good boy. Okay. See, so, yeah, I think if I feed the dogs meat, I ex suspect I can just like get past them and I just get 20 bucks every time. Unfortunately, Burb does not have hands. So he can't, he can't grab the meat. Ooh, Pisazor. That was a pretty cool jaw shape, not gonna lie. Okay, where am I missing? Is it inside? It's gotta be inside. Yum. Just do my little stippy steps. <laughs> Another tricuboid, okay. I feel like legs and arm shapes should have been grouped as one, you know? Like if you unlock the tricuboid, it would unlock for both arms and legs. Am I wrong? Okay, and then I saw... Yeah, okay, so they are popping up on the minimap when I get close enough, so it's just because I haven't explored everywhere. So that makes sense, okay. I thought it was just showing them all when I looked at the map. I didn't realize that it was only showing me the ones that I've been nearby. That's kind of nice, though. It incentivizes you to actually, you know, explore. Audio dish. And the little quests around. Boop, boop. With my little stubby legs. Stoop, 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 stoop. I've lost my music again because we went to the sandbox. Womp womp. Another bone? Dem dry bones. Fair. There's a well. Oh, I have to throw coins down the well. But I will need Nursilla for that. I need three coins? Well, there's one. Have I even seen any other coins? I don't think I have. Maybe I have and I've just walked past them. Toothless. He sure is. Like, is there a coin? Oh, there's a coin there. Actually, wait, I'm a bird. Here, let me get a bird's eye view. Har har. So one coin, two coins. Do I see a third coin anywhere? Oh yeah, there are three coins. Okay. So let me whoop. And we'll grab Nursilla, load. And he is slow, I know. But let's go make some quick cash on the wishing well. I, I say quick cash, I mean very slow cash, unfortunately, for Nursilla. And I can't pick up two things at once, can I? Oh, I can! <laughs> can I pick up three things at once? 
I only have two hands. No, okay. It doesn't let me. I do need three hands to pick up three things. Got it. Am I tall enough for this? Wonk. Oh, okay. Good. Yeah, another hundred bucks. I won't say no to a free hundo. Alright, Nursilla. Let's go get some money. There we go. Got a hundred dollars. So now we have eight hundred and fifty dollars, I do believe. Okay. Again, not too shabby. We're gonna slowly meander over and get this pattern. And I mean very slowly. I should probably make like a speed critter. Maybe I'll reconfigure Burb, or um, sorry, not Burb, Creamsicle for next time. And uh, I'll make him a little faster and slimmer so he can maybe fly. So he can be all, our all-purpose guy. I'll just give him all the abilities I can. Probably should have switched back to Burb. I thought this was gonna be closer. <laughs> You guys enjoying the nice little forest stroll? You know, just spending time in nature with the giant spiders. Good times, good times. Again, one of these days I really will have to check out what other people have created in terms of like the highest ranked critters. Trunk. Like I'm sure there's some way to see it. Other than just the ones that you vote on on the main page. There's got to be like a top gallery. Oh. Can I get up here? I wish I had like grippy legs, you know? Oh, okay, never mind. Nursilla's got hops. <laughs> Good job, Nursilla. I guess I could have gone this way. Oh no. I thought that was a lower point. That's a point over there. Okay. But yeah, we I will reconfigure Creamsicle for next time, and I'll catch up with you guys later. So thank you for joining me this week, and I'll see you next week.